Well, today's a good day on hooking up my new outdoor radio system. In the backyard, finally gonna get them hooked up. I've had them for a little while now. So you can see I have 20 speakers here. These are all Bogans, which is a commercial 70 volt speaker. This is an indoor speaker setup. These are ceiling speakers, as you can see here. They're mounted up in the ceiling. They have an enclosure. I have one put together right here. And they have a grill. Okay, this one I painted red. I'm gonna paint, probably gonna paint them all different colors, depending on what I'm gonna do with them, where I'm gonna put them. So this is what I got going on here. The enclosure and the grill. Okay, so now the enclosure is pretty cool. I can have that in the direct sun or in the rain, not gonna matter, and here's where the wire goes through. As long as I have that sealed or in a down position like so, it's not gonna matter. There's not gonna be water accessing this. Back here, where it's connected, I could silicone that, and probably that's what I'm gonna do. Yeah, these are the same speakers that you would find at a hospital, Home Depot, office buildings, for example. And these will be something that you would want to have for your space to allow a lot of sound to come in. With a new receiver, this allows me to have four zones. So I'm going to have um, five speakers per zone, maybe six. Now with this Bogan receiver, you can hook up as many speakers as you want, as long as you don't exceed the total wattage of your amplifier. So this just happens to be a 35 watt amp. These speakers here, the transformers, have different taps. It allows you to adjust for the wattage that you're going to use. Now, most of them I'm going to use are 2 watts, which doesn't sound like a lot, but I'm going to hook them all up right here so we can see how it sounds all together on this table. See all these different colors? These are taps. Now, each color represents a different wattage. Now, here's a chart that we can base off everything. Okay, we have 70 volts. Yellow is going to be 4 watts. Green is going to be 2 watts. Blue is going to be 1 and then etc. go all the way down to 1 8 watt. Now that's going to be good since I'm hooking up in the backyard. If I'm near the property line, I can make it real quiet. Um, for the most part, I have it all figured out. I'm going to use the green wire, which is this, and that is going to give me 2 watts. Okay, and the way I'm going to have this set up, as far as the wiring goes, I'm going to have 15 speakers. I have 20 total. 15 speakers are going to be set at 2 watts. That brings us up to 30 watts and the other five remaining speaker will each be one watt. And so the two watts is the green wire, one watt's the blue wire. Now let's take a look at an enclosure. The stock enclosure has styrofoam on the inside and that'll help insulate it from the sun if any are actually out in the sun. I might have a few out there in the sun, probably four or so that'll be exposed to the elements fully. And the other ones will be underneath the eaves or in sheds. Um, spread about like that. So here's the enclosure and these are all the grills. So here are the stock grills. All white. That one's painted black. I just wanted to get an idea of how they would look. Here's a red one, a black one. Now I have different color paints I'm going to choose from as I do this. Um, black, red, green, and aluminum. I'm probably going to do a lot of them aluminum. That'll probably just be the default color I'm going to choose. Okay, now that I showed you a little bit about the transformers and the different colors with the different wattage, I showed you the enclosures, the different colors I'm going to use, grills that are down here. You kind of get an idea of what's going on. I'm going to wire this thing up. Here's my things. And get all these speakers going. Alright, I have all the speakers hooked up. All in series. You can see I daisy chain one from another. So let's give it a shot. Let's hear how it sounds. I have some non copyrighted music up on the internet. Let's check it out. Okay, so you heard it already. I have them all hooked up. Let's hear another sound, another beat. And for reference, I'll just set all the, um, these the bass and treble to the default. Okay, and now just for the sake of making a video, I put wire nuts in each speaker just so you can kind of see some of the bass reflex, how they shake, and that they are all in fact on. Now remember, it's going to sound a lot better when the enclosure is on, but here's a sample of what it does just for what it is.
All right, so I rewired every speaker, put them all on the green wire. So what that does is give me two watts per speaker, and yeah, it really does make a big difference, huge. It sounds so much better, clear, and like powerful now.